Um, so I practice, I'm a partner at Blaney McMurtry. I practice in the corporate commercial department. I specialize in mergers and acquisitions and I do other corporate work. I think in terms of how I chose the area I'm in, um, I think it was a little bit by accident. Um, as a law student, I really honestly didn't think that I would be interested in corporate work. But while doing my business rotation, at Blaney's, I quickly realized that I wanted to be doing um, business and I wanted to be working with the individuals that I was working with at Blaney's. Um, as an associate and a student working on transactional work, you realize that you, um, you learn a lot of unique things about your clients, unique things about their industry, and you get to have a positive impact on your clients at the end of the day, whether it's a personal or business growth. And that's very rewarding. Uh, yeah, I think there's two things in particular that I've learned through um, mentors over the years and very at a very young age, I think. Um, the first is probably from my parents. <laughs> They're the ones who really motivated me to get an education um, and watching their hard work and their desire to do better is something that I took very seriously. So I incorporated their work ethic in my every day and I was adamant about not taking advantage of opportunities or not not taking advantage of opportunities. Um, the other um, lesson that I learned was probably at a very young age as well from a high school teacher who basically said don't fall in love with the words that you come up with and so I uh, applied that more than just to my writing skills. I applied that to me personally and what that means is that I'm willing to analyze myself in a little more critical way. I'm willing to understand what my motivations are behind what I do, and I'm open to alternatives. So I think that makes for a better professional me and a better personal me. Um, in terms of community involvement, I've been involved with the South Asian Bar Association as a member since I've articled at Blaney's, um, and then I was on the board of directors for a period of time and vice president, only recently stepping down. I'm currently on the executive committee of our North, Amer North American Parent Association, um, and I represent the firm with the law firm Inclusion Diversity Network. In terms of my involvement with Saba Toronto and Saba North, America. I'm, I'm really incredibly proud of the work that we do. We do a lot of work for both our membership in terms of um, advocacy work on the legal professional side, and we do a lot of work in terms of promoting and helping out uh, the community, South Asian community in, in general. Um, so it's been incredibly rewarding work to be able to, to know that I am able to facilitate both those things on either of those ends, and as well, um, uh, one of the things I'm passionate about is being able to be a mentor, and I've been able to do that uh, informally and formally through SABA. As corporate counsel, I bring um, several things um, to my role to, to my clients, but on, uh, I, I think, a personal level, I think I bring the, uh, uh, the idea of ease and confidence to clients that things are going to get done on a a timely and efficient manner. Transactional work is such that you're really working with tight deadlines and you're invariably going to come up with issues that come up in the last minute and you have to deal with them. Uh, and if you're not focused on the right things, you can become the detriment to your client's transaction. You have to be the one who essentially creates focus, is willing to hone in resources, um, and is willing to come up with practical solutions in order to get the transaction done for your client and also make it simple and accessible for them at the end of the day. And I think I am able to do that for clients.